name is Arjun Ramesh. Um, I completed 12th standard from Kaisnagar English Higher Secondary School, Trivandrum. I am staying at Manakar. Uh, my hobbies are uh, singing, watching TV, etc. And um, I have many friends. And I am trying to get admission in Christ University, Bangalore. I am going to Bangalore next week uh, for an interview and preparing for the test and all. That's all about myself. Thank you. Before 10 years, when I, when I was a second grade student in Arya Central School, Trivandrum, I remember my science teacher teaching me a lesson with the slogan, Save our environment, save the world. And also she told that uh, this, uh, this slogan is followed by the people all around the, all, all people around the world. Suddenly, I realized that it was my birthday on June 5th. So, I understood that there is nothing much beautiful than being born on World Environmental Day. About myself, my name is Arjun Ramesh and I am 17 years old. I completed my 10th standard from Arya Central School and after, completing, after, after my 10th standard, I joined Kreisnagar English Higher Secondary School for my higher secondary studies. Now, um, I completed 12th standard and I am waiting for my results. Then, um, now it is vacation. Um, I'm planning to do IATA course after, after doing MBA. And um, as I'm very interested in the field of tourism. And that's all about myself. Thank you. Hello everyone. Good afternoon to one and all. My name is Arjun Ramesh and I am standing here in front of you to speak a few words about the topic entrepreneurship in India. Before that, I will introduce myself. I completed my 10th standard from Arya Central School. Uh, after that, I joined Kreisnaga School for my high secondary education. Now I am waiting for my 12th standard results. And uh, my future plan is to do BBA and MBA. And coming to the topic, uh, entrepreneurship in India. Before two years, when I was a 10th standard student in Arya Central School, <coughs> when I was a 10th standard student in Arya Central School, I saw a notice and I saw that, in that notice, I saw that um, from next year onwards for 11th standard students, uh, we are introducing a new stream, a new subject for commerce stream. The subject was called entrepreneurship. First, when I saw this word, I was not at all able to pronounce it. I was not even able to pronounce it, but I was very interested to know the meaning of entrepreneurship. Suddenly, I was very, I was wondering about this meaning of the entrepreneurship and I asked my friend, what was the meaning? He told me that entrepreneurship, entrepreneurship is nothing but knowing, doing our own business rather than going for a job for a salary. At that time onwards, at that moment onwards, my greatest wish in life was to become an entrepreneur. And uh, from that moment, um, my plan was to do BBA and MBA. And uh, for that, uh, as my first step, I have applied in one of the greatest colleges in India, in Christ University, Bangalore for doing BBA. And my future plan is to do MBA. And after that, I will definitely do IATA course and will soon start a very great business and will become a, a great entrepreneur very soon. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Arjun Ramesh and I'm standing before you to deliver a few words on the topic. Are, our, are we producing a generation of burned out children? Yes, I agree with this. We are definitely producing a generation of burned out children. Nowadays, we cannot see even one child without a mobile phone. I'm not saying that mobile phones are causing harm to the children, but it has both good effects and also bad effects. We should understand it and act accordingly. In public places such as trains, bus, etc., we can see children coming and sitting, and after that, they will definitely, uh, they will always start. They would always start hearing uh, songs with earphones. Uh, instead of hearing these songs, they could uh, observe observe the environment. 
with these white wires they are indicating that they could uh, they are not ready to uh, mingle with the children sitting near them so this is the problem of this generation children we should uh, we should not we are living in an environment where we should we should observe everything and we should mingle with everyone so we should not be like this this is the problem of this generation children and um, uh, they are uh, this generation children are uh, are in their own world they are not ready to mingle with anyone and uh, it is our responsibility to change this world by uh, by saving the future generation and that's all hello everyone i am standing before you to speak a few words about the changes which which inspire are made in my life before that i will introduce me my name is arjun ramesh i completed my 12th standard from christanga school trivandrum now it's vacation for me uh, before one week uh, before one month my school life ended and after that i was very lazy to join a spoken english institute and to study this interview skills and all uh, and my pa and my parents forced me to go to this institution at that time i i i didn't know anything about this but uh, now uh, being the last day of this uh, of this 25 hour course at inspira i feel very sad to leave this institution and uh, and now only i understood the value of this institution i thank uh, two trainers rohit sir and shruti ma'am uh, for giving such a nice training and i feel uh, a great difference in me before that i was not able to uh, attend any interview or i was not confident to do anything but now i am very confident that uh, i will be able to crack the christ college interview and i will make uh, make this institution proud by uh, by cracking the interview and i am sure about it Hoping for the best. Thank you. Inspire.